Hey, what up, guys? It's your boys, Common Kings, and um, I think for me personally, one of my dream tours would be, of course, the King of Pop, Michael Jackson. Um, mm -hmm. For so many reasons, um, he's an idol of mine, vocally and performance, and just in every way. That guy's uh, still the man. My dream tour would probably—that's <clears throat> a good one. I was gonna say the King of Pop, but I'll probably do uh, Jimi Hendrix opening up for the Beatles. That would be a dream tour. Those two acts together, never been done before. I'd recommend that because those are two big pioneers in the music world. Oh, with us too? Yeah, I don't, my dream tour would be with um, maybe someone like uh, Kendrick Lamar, some hip hop, I like the hip hop influence. Um, and uh, 311. Ooh. Yeah. That would be a sick tour. Uh, that's a tough one. <laughs> my dream tour, I have a few. So, starting off with my lady, Gwen Stefani, and no doubt. Ooh. Right. That's one. Yes. Uh, my next one would be, you know what, just for kicks, um, Guns N' Roses and uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Those would be some pretty amazing uh, tours. And then uh, we've been actually been privileged enough to be on a few dream tours already with uh, Justin and Tristan Fifth Harmony, Harmony Fifth and uh, CeeLo. So, um, those would be the ones from past. Present, Megan Trainer. Come on, girl. Let's go. Let's make it happen, Megan.